anybody's wondering why there's like a floating camera behind my head it's because we're shooting a behind the scenes so i am showing people how to make how to go live on instagram and the benefits for it <laughs> there's i've heard it a few times people are promising hacks or quick growth or like the fastest way to your next hundred thousand but what i'm about to tell you is the exact path that i did to gain over a hundred thousand followers in a year i can tell you that this simple method has increased my visibility in the algorithm. It has resulted in more DMs. It's resulted in people signing up for my newsletter. Tool number one, your phone, because you are going to go live on Instagram. Now, before you tune away, hang on with me, I promise. I'm gonna deliver and I'm gonna go live and show you exactly how easy it is. But first, let's set it up with tool number two. This is called desk view is that it will adhere to a window. I'm gonna go set it up in a window. And don't worry, just in case you don't have one of these or a window, I'm gonna show you a little workaround to that too. So my first location is going to be in my kitchen window. And as I'm going live, I'm gonna walk you through my second location so you can actually see everything from both angles and pick one that works for you. So I have this and I place it in a window and it's super easy to set up. I just place it against the window and I press down and now it's a suction cup so I can place my phone right about here when I'm ready to go live so we're in location number one I'm by my kitchen window and just outside the window there's a white wall and it's pushing light back into my face so what I've done is I've gotten a paper towel and I've just folded it because what I'll do is I'll rest it against the window before I go live because I don't have a phone tripod. So what I'm gonna do is I am going to open my Instagram live app. I'll hit on the live button and I'll make sure it's pulled back looking at me. And then if I want, I can add a filter. I, I add a skin softening filter. Why not, right? Or I can add something else. But today we'll try this. So I have my paper towel. I have this ready to go. I make sure that my Wi-Fi is on point. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna press go live. Ooh, I always get nervous. Here we go. Hi friends, how are you? Happy Friday. I'm popping in for a random coffee and conversations, but today I ain't got no coffee. Why? I actually don't know why, but I am actually here to serve you well. So if you don't know who I am, my name is Jasmine Starr. I am a photographer and business strategist, and I am your home girl from Newport Beach, here to answer your questions. If you're new to the hood, what you do is you simply scroll to the top of your feed and you hit the request button. By hitting the request button, you will come on live with me and ask a question. And in case anybody's wondering why there's like a floating camera behind my head, it's because we're shooting a behind the scenes. So I am showing people how to make, how to go live on Instagram and the benefits for it. So that, that video is gonna be posted to IGTV. So keep your eyes peeled. Okay, so I'm gonna, um, so, so far, just right now, there are three people who've requested to go live. I'm gonna select Andrew. So Andrew's gonna come on and he's gonna ask his question and we're just gonna make a day of this. So Andrew, you're gonna be on camera, on live, and on a video. Hey Andrew, what's up? Oh, hello. How are you? Oh, good, thank you, I didn't miss that <laughs> No worries, well you requested, so here you are, what's your question? Yeah, I've always requested, I've never had someone actually accept, thank you. I appreciate, I appreciate. I'm in a small area compared to you guys out in America. So. That's <laughs> fine, that is totally, totally fine, and it's crazy. What you think is small is a reframe to, it's only small in here, because when you hold the phone in your hand, it's massive. So make sure that you know that there is an audience and a client for you, as long as you're willing to work hard and build the content to attract them. Brilliant, thank, thank you. Thank you, I appreciate it, thanks friend. Thank you, bye. <laughs> bye. Okay, so what we're also going to do, I mean, that he was great. I mean, honestly, y'all know I'm a big fan of British accents. Like, I just felt so much smarter just talking to him. Just have him talking to me. It's like, legitimately, I just am really much smarter. Okay, um, let's see. Uh, let's go into a question. So what I just did is I, I, you can submit a question. I clicked on the question. It says, from Pastor Didi, what's the best advice for a novice, someone who's about to start Instagram consulting? Well, I want you to pass on this very deep advice. Consistency. You don't have to be the best. You don't have to be the cutest, the richest, the thinnest, the youngest, the funniest, the prettiest. 
You don't have to be any of those things except for consistent. Consistency goes to those who remain undaunted and say, I am going to show up come hell or high water. When you are just starting out, you will have every objective not to get online. I don't have a good photo. I don't know what to say. My house is a mess. My hair ain't done. My lashes ain't good. You can find all the reasons. But instead of finding excuses why you won't show up on Instagram every day to be consistent, I want you to find the reasons why you will make it work in spite of all those other things. Because I stand as a living and walking, breathing testament that I am not the best, and I am not the cutest, and I am not the richest, and I am not the most successful. But you wanna know one thing that nobody can back me down from? I'm consistent. I show up on the green every day and I hit the dang ball. I stand on the three point line, uh, I said three point. The free, what is that line? The free throw. I know basketball, I played it. Free throw. I stand on the free throw line and I take those shots every single day. Even if I'm missing, I'm still showing up. So the best advice that I got for a novice is the best advice that I got for a professional. Show up, no excuses. Wow, did I just get heated? Did I just get heated? I think I just got heated and you wanna know what? No apologies, bring out a fan. Okay, so I'm gonna change things up right now. I'm gonna bring somebody else to go on live with me, but I want to show a slightly different location of how I can go live. So right now we're going live. You guys, we're being super meta. We're being super meta. So we're going live on Instagram, and then I'm gonna turn a tutorial. I'm gonna make a tutorial for IGTV. So now I'm in a different location. Hold on, let me show you so that y'all see. Look at what we have here. We have a, like a debt, like I don't know what that thing is. But right here, this is like a stand-up desk that adheres to a window. So there you go. And don't judge my garden. Did you see my garden? Don't judge it. I had to, I had, we're, it's fall is coming. So I had to like fix the garden. So we had all of our flowers. Uh, like I don't, I don't live like a savage, okay? There's a pile of dirt in my front lawn, but that's okay, I'm gonna fix that. Where is this coming from? No idea. Uh, okay, so let's go into, let's bring somebody else on live because that's what we do. If you're just tuning in. Hi, welcome. If you request to go live, you will come on camera with me. And my, I'm so nervous, my hands are shaking, I can't even press my phone. Hold on. <laughs> my fingers are on fire. No, I'm just kidding. I literally, like legitimately, my phone's not working. Oh, there it is. Whew, got me all nervous up in here. Okay, um, let's go on to, yeah. Let's go to an Instagram marketing specialist. Let's have a little conversation. Who doesn't want to talk about Instagram marketing? I know I do. Uh, okay, here we go. Yes, Marcus Murphy, you know I'm tripping and I'm nervous. Hi, Queen, how are you? Hi, Jasmine. Uh, you made my evening. Actually, I'm in Bratislava, Slovakia. This is the Europe we have evening. And I was just scrolling and seeing you are alive. Thank you very much. Uh, Thank you. Really appreciate it. It's like my, my heart is uh, pumping. Ah, <laughs> oh, no, hey, there's no reason. No reason to stress. We're just two girls having a good time on Instagram. What is your question? Thank you. Oh, that is so <laughs> cute. Thank, Thank you, you doll. Much. Have a good one. Have a nice day. You Bye -bye. too. Bye. Okay, so what are you going to do with your time? Be strategic. Do the best you can, show up on Instagram, serve the people who are there on your account, speak to them clearly, respond to your direct messages, respond to every comment, create content with consistency. I don't know about you, but we started this question, we started this live with one thing, consistency. And we are gonna end this conversation on the same thing, consistency. Can I get an amen? If you are willing to be consistent for seven days in a row, can you right now do me a solid, give me a hard tap? I, I heard that, hard tap, hard love? Dang it, I messed it up. Hard love or hard tap, I don't know, is when somebody likes it, like when they co-sign. If you're willing to be consistent for the next seven days, give me a hard tap, hard love. I don't even know I'm not that cool. All I'm saying is show up right now and let me know how you feel about being consistent on Instagram. Thumbs up, emoji, a heart, because what I wanna do is just spur you on and push you forward and let you know that what you're doing might not feel like it's working now and it might not feel like it's working tomorrow, but the more you show up and you serve well, it will work in the future. Can I get an amen? All right, y'all, happy, happy day. Go out, slay, have fun, enjoy. Call your mom, tell your lover. Bye, guys. So I'm not gonna pick the funk. I know that what I'm saying is intimidating, 
but success goes to those who remain undaunted. So right about now, I'm sure you're nervous, right? I hear you whispering off in the distance, Jasmine, I only have 20 followers. Who's gonna show up and watch me live? And guess what, baby boo? Chances are, ain't nobody gonna watch you live. Nobody watched me live for the beginning of my lives for a very long time. And you want to know what I learned by going live and nobody watching me? is that your live stays live 24 hours. And I realized that even if people weren't watching me live, they were able to watch a replay. And the replay is where the gold is. The replay is where you start getting DMs because when somebody leaves a comment as they're watching your live, when it's not live, it turns into a DM. Friends, that's the magic. I'm asking you and begging you, if you wanna grow on the platform, do things that make you uncomfortable. I am here to support your success. So, not if, when you go live, I don't want you going live once. I want you to create a pattern. I made the commitment to myself to go live once a week for a full month. And then once I got through the month, I was like, okay, I can do it another month. And then that second month to a third month. And now we're going on two years of going live. So if you want tools to succeed on Instagram, download my free Instagram marketing guide. You can find that at jasminestar.com forward slash IG marketing guide. And when you go live, send me a DM. I want to clap you up.